Hello children, welcome to EVS class. Children, we have been learning about the topic transport and in the last week we learned about land transport. Now today we will continue with the same topic but different mode of transport. You have to guess which mode of transport we are going to learn today. So I am going to recite one rhyme and you are going to listen carefully. Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 life is but a dream. Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 life is but a dream. So children, any guesses? Yes, right. We are going to learn water transport today. Our today's topic is water transport. Means of transport that move only on water are called water transport. Sailboat, rowboat, then ship, cruise, fishing boat, then yacht, then submarine. All these are water transport. All these are water transport. And they are used to transport people and goods from one place to another. And it is the cheapest mode of transport. Today, let's learn few water transport in detail. Let's start. This is a boat. It is used to travel short distances on water across lakes and rivers. People often go for boating for fun and entertainment. Boats come in many different sizes and types. This is a rowboat. It is smaller than a ship and can be lifted out of the water. It moves on water with the help of oars. This is a sailboat. Sailboats are boats with sails or large pieces of cloth. Sails catch the wind which helps the sailboat to reach its destination. This is a yacht. It is a comfortable water transport. People can live inside it and can travel in it. This is a ship. A ship is huge. It can carry a large number of people and goods as well as very heavy loads over long distances on water across oceans and seas. This is a submarine. It is very large. It travels underwater. It is used to study about sea and ocean activities. So children, did you enjoy the topic water transport? Keep revising and we will continue with the same topic in the next video. Till then, bye. See you in the next class.